Hello everyone, welcome back to another video of trailer explanation. In this video, we are going to cover the last unit of this module, which is learn about configured code and description. Uh, so this unit is from the module configurable bundles in Salesforce CPQ. So in this unit's challenge, what we are going to cover up here is we will see how we can create package product code for any product that we have in our Salesforce CPQ package. So uh, let's quickly launch our trailer playground and see. So I'll give you the basic use of this uh, package product code. It, it just gives the simplicity to the sales rep to configure what all uh, features a product has without even opening the product detail page. It's just give the product uh, description of the product in the product a package product code. You'll get more clarity once we uh, do this challenge in action. So let's launch our uh, trailer playground. I've already done that. You have to go to app launcher and from here, just select the Salesforce CPQ application. Now, once it is loaded, we have to go to our product tab like this. And the product that we are going to uh, work upon in this challenge is digital camera product. So let's just go back here. So right now I'm in recently viewed list view. So we have to go to all products list view in order to select camera product. So uh, the product that we have is digital camera product. So we have to go to D alphabet and there it is digital camera. Just open this up. Now, what we have to do is uh, so there are multiple product options related to this uh, digital camera product. So there are two product uh, options. One is 64 GB SD card and other one is 256 GB SD card. So let's just go back there and the component code that we are going to provide is this and this is the code position. So let's just go back there and go to related tabs. So here you can see there are two product options. One is 64 GB SD card and 256 GB SD card. So let's do this for uh, each of these product options one by one. Click on edit. Now here uh, there is this field. If you will scroll a little bit towards downward, uh, there is this field in the advanced setting section that component code. And this is the component code position field. So let's just copy this from the challenge, which is a uh, hash, uh, I'm sorry, hyphen 64 GB. Copy this in the component code. So this is the code uh, for this product, which is uh, 64 GB SD card, right? And the po position for this code is one. So let's just add, add one here in this field. Click on save. And the code for the 256 GB SD card is, if I'll just go to edit, go to advanced settings section, the code is 250, uh, hyphen 256 GB. I will just copy this and paste this in the component code. Again, its position is also one. Click on save. Now, next thing we have to go to digital camera product and configure this code pattern. So I will just copy this. So what code pattern will do is camera, this is going to be there in every product option that we are going to select. Uh, this will appear in every uh, package product code for every product option camera. After that, this is dynamic value. So it is going to fetch this one. It will find out all the product option that has component position as one. So here it will find that these are the two options and based on the product option that I have selected, it will pick up the component code for that particular product option. So let's just go back uh, to our digital camera product, go to detail tab. And here there is this field configure code pattern. So I have to edit this, click on edit and I'll copy this. So there is this field uh, configured code pattern, paste this over here. So this uh, one in curly brackets just signifies that this value is going to be dynamic based on whatever product option that we are selecting in our edit lines. Just click on save. Once 
once it is saved we have to go to our edge communication account and then from there we have to go to our opportunity camera from marketing team opportunity so let's just go to uh so i'll open accounts on a new tab so that we can uh revisit this setting that we have done in uh product detail page. So let's just go to accounts. There is this edge communication in my recently viewed list. If at all, it is not coming in yours. You can just go to this drop down and click on all accounts and then you can search for edge communication over there. Just click on this, go to related tabs, scroll to opportunity. And the opportunity that we have to go for is camera for marketing team opportunity. So let's just go to again, this click on view all. So there is this opportunity camera for marketing team. Open this up in the uh, related section. You will find quotes, open this code double zero double zero eight, click on edit lines and the product that we have to add is it's basically a bundle. So digital camera bundle, we have to add, go back there. So edit lines is loading. And with a digital camera bundle, we have to select 256 GB storage option. So click on add products, scroll to D, or you can directly just search it from the search bar. Click on digital camera. This is the bundle that we have to add. Click on select. Now, these are the two options that we were able to see on our uh, product detail uh, related tab under options. So 64 and 256 GB and the same we are getting over here in the storage feature. Now we have to select 256 one. So select this one. So radio button over here, if you see uh, against the product options, if there are radio buttons, that means you have, you can select only one. But if there are uh, check boxes against each product option, that means you can select more than one. So that gives us uh, the ability to select multiple product options, but with radio buttons, uh, we can select only one. So in our case, we have to select 256 GB one, just uh, select this and click on save. Now here is the summary of the code lines that will be created once I click on save. So here, if you will just go to this arrow uh, on your right hand side, there you will see that package product code is coming up over here and you will find that camera is the uh, is the code coming from the field which we added over here in the configured code pattern and one is dynamically uh, one uh, position that we have given is dynamically uh, fetched from the product option that we have selected so 256 gb is coming from the product that we have selected over here so if i uh, if you you can try this on your own instead of selecting 256 uh, just select 64 gb sd card and you will notice that this will again dynamically be changed so this is how you can uh, uh, configure your package product code. So this is just simply going to give the uh, sales rep the ability to see what all features or description of the product options that are related to this product bundle. So let's just click on save. And our quote line has been created. If you hover over this, there are two quote lines. One is the lead product and other one is the product option. And that's all we have to do. Let's just go back and check whether we have passed this challenge or not. There you go. This unit as well as this module is completed. See you in the next video with another unit or module. Till then, take care. Thank you so much.